So I'm going to show you how to um, use free, downloadable, or um, other digital kits that you can purchase on the internet with Creative Memories Storybook Creator Plus 3.0. So one way of doing it is adding them as photos. So you can click Get Photos from File and then I have all my kits here that I've downloaded. Most of them are free. And most of them I get from Summertime Designs dot blogspot dot com so um, like this is one kit called ring it in um, and so I'm just gonna show you I'm just gonna add in two to save time <clears throat> so I can make this photo a background to make um, as a background for my page I can um, crop this photo to make as um, a shape and I can use different elements by bringing them in as well or maybe just you can use um, elements from digital kits in your scrapbook pages um, the only thing that you can't do with downloaded packages is um, like things you can do with the papers um, that are Creative Memories packages. So when I click on here, I can um, cut a shape out of this background. So I can choose a bunch of different shapes here. And make a shape with that paper um, but you can't or I haven't found a way to make um, a shape with this background so the only way I found that you can make shapes from these um, these kits is if you do them in Adobe first um, there may be ways on Storybook Creator that you can do them but I haven't figured that out yet so um, I usually just do them on Adobe and then bring them into my storybook creator. So um, that's one way. I'm just going to get rid of these images here. Okay, another way is to go to insert and then you can click embellishment or paper and you can go from a file. So you can bring an embellishment in from a file one at a time, which is an easier way of doing things because when you're doing a scrapbook on Storybook Creator, you'll have all your photos here and it's harder to search through all your photos and your backgrounds and everything rather than just bringing them in one at a time. When you click um, paper, you can it'll ask you if you want to make it your background you can click yes or no if you click yes it'll make it the background if you click no you can move it around and make it big or small so um, that's how you can use downloaded um, scrapbook kits in your storybook creator